Trading View strategy tester tells me that this strategy has made over 4,100 USDC profit in the last two weeks. And in this video, I will show you how to do automated trading with Trading View webhook using any of these strategies. The first step to use the automated trading is to choose which trading pair you want to trade. You can choose it easily here on the search bar. You can choose for all and type your favorite trading pair here on the top. For today's video, I have chosen BTC USDC perpetual contract, but you can apply the same method with other trading pairs as well. Then you can click here for indicators and you can type here strategy. And you can use any of the strategies here available on TradingView and also these strategies created by the community, so other traders, and you can even create your own strategy if you want. If you want to choose any of the built-in strategies, you can click here for technicals, and then here you see the strategies. Let me click for one to show you an example, Bollinger Band strategy. It draws that here in the chart, and then it also puts it here in the strategy tester, and it calculates the profit and loss for the last two weeks. And according to this calculation, it has made more than 8,000 USDC profit. Keep in mind that this historical return is not the guarantee of the future. So even though a method might have made money in the past, it doesn't mean that it will keep on making profits also in the future. If you want to close the strategy, you can click here to remove, and then it removes that specific one. The next step is to connect to a trading platform. And here on trading view, you can come into the broker section and here they list all the trading platforms, including crypto exchanges. If you click here for crypto, it shows you many different platforms for crypto, for example, Binance, OKX, Bybit, and also other ones. If it doesn't show your favorite platform here immediately, you can search it through Google, for example, BitGet Trading View, then you click right here and you are able to trade with BitGet through Trading View. Same also with other platforms, for example, Bing X Trading View, you click here and you are able to trade. Today's example I will show you with Binance because it's number one ranked right here. And you know it's also number one ranked crypto exchange in the world with over 30 billion USDT daily trading volume. They have more than 290 million users worldwide, which is probably more than the population of your country. Binance also provides many built-in trading bots, so you wouldn't even necessarily need to use TradingView. You can see here, for example, with this Bitcoin DCA bot, I made more than $28,000 profit. However, when you trade with the TradingView strategies, you are able to use much more advanced strategies than with just the built-in trading bots here on Binance. So that's the benefit of connecting TradingView and Binance for automated trading. I have also created tutorials helping you to use TradingView with other platforms, for example, BingX, BitGet, Bybit. You can find all of them easily on my YouTube channel, Learn to Make Honest Money Online. And if you want me to create a TradingView tutorial related to any specific broker platform, let me know in the comments below and I would love to hear from you. When you choose your favorite platform, you can click here learn more and then you can click here trade. When you do that for the first time, you need to do the connection as I've shown you in my previous videos. Once you are on the trading platform, you want to choose the same trading pair that you have chosen on trading view. And in this example, I will be using BTC USDC perpetual contract. So I have opened the same one here on Binance in the futures USDC perpetual BTC USDC. Just to quickly give you the proof that you can do the same also on other platforms, here is Bybit, BTC USDC Perpetual, and here you can click this button on the right. You scroll down a little bit and you click here Webhook Signal Trading. Trade automatically with signals from Trading View. You can click right here and it will walk you through the same process that you can do on Binance and other platforms. You click here create now, then you click here to create the webhook and you follow the process. Here on Binance you can find it on the bots section. So you click here bots and then you click here webhook signal trading. 
and then you click here create new webhook here it says create a webhook on Binance and you click here confirm and proceed but before you come into this one you may want to check one thing if you are trading with a small amount of money you can check here what is the minimum for each trade if I type here 0, it says minimum is 0 0.01 BTC, so roughly a 22 USDC investment using the 5x leverage. Notice here that if you choose USDC by order size and you type here 0, then it shows the minimum quantity is 111 USDC. But that is not the amount that you need to put for the trade. That is the whole amount counting your amount and the leverage. So if you want to see the exact margin that you need to put, you click here initial margin, you type here zero and then it shows you what is the minimum margin. So the minimum money that you need to put for each trade with the current leverage. And let's check also with the order size. Minimum is 0 0.001 BTC, roughly 111 USDC. So now if I click here create new webhook, the minimum order size that I need to put here is 111 USDC because otherwise it would not execute the trade. Here you can put the signal name. Let me put here YouTube example 2. Here you choose the trading pair. In this case we are trading the USDC, BTC and here the order size. Now if I put 120 for example, that is fine. Then it will be trading 0.001 BTC each time. If I would put let's say 150, it still trades the same 0.001 USDC. If I would put for example 220, now it would trade 0.002 BTC each time because now it goes already over that amount. I will just put here 130 USDC for example purposes and if you feel it's easier you can also put it in BTC. Here is the position mode, we have chosen the heads mode, position side, long or short, so the direction, do you expect BTC to go higher, long, do you expect BTC to go lower, then you choose short. We of course choose long, order type limit, or get limit order or market order, with limit you may save some money on the fees, with market you will save some time on the execution. Let me choose here market, then the leverage is 5x, so every trade is 5 times amplified. Then you can double check the details and click here create signal. Then it gives you clear instructions. Go to trading view to customize your signal, so basically choose the strategy as I explained to you in the beginning. Then it says input your alert webhook URL, input alert message so let me show you where you can input both of those so now i click here alert then i click here message and here i will copy paste the message from binance i click here copy and i paste the message here you don't want to share your message for the other people for safety and security purposes here you can put the alert name let me put youtube example 2 then you click here notifications and now you copy the webhook URL and then you paste it right here on the webhook URL. And now before you click here create, there is one extremely important thing that you must notice. The condition here. Here you can choose the condition when this bot will be trading. And if you want to trade based on your strategy, you need to have opened it here. As you can see, I have opened bar up and down strategy. And then you choose it as a condition here. So bar up and down strategy. If you forget to click for that there, it may trade based on the wrong strategy or the wrong indicator. So it's extremely important that you choose the right one here. Then you choose the trading interval. Keep in mind that if you choose too short time frame, for example a couple of seconds, couple of minutes, fees may eat most of the profits. I will show you a good example in a moment. But on the other hand, if you choose too long time frame, many days or weeks for example, then it may trade very rarely. So choose the right balance for you. I will just choose one minute for the example purposes of this video, so we can get some examples fast. I click here create and now we can go here on the right hand side alerts and you can see YouTube example is right here. In a moment we may hear a notification when it executes the first trade. I go here on the Binance, I click here run webhook 
and now you can see it has been added here on the webhook signal trading youtube example 2 is running right now if you ever want to edit pause or delete you can do it here on trading view the first one is for pausing the second one is to edit your alert and the third one is deleted needless to say when you want to trade with your strategies you want to have some funds available in your trading account and you can transfer easily by clicking this transfer button from your spot account to your futures account meanwhile we are waiting for the first orders to trigger let me show you some details of the previous example that i opened earlier today i will click here for view details and here we will see the youtube example I scroll down a little bit and I zoom into open orders at, at the moment the strategy has been paused so there are no open orders at the moment and if I click here for order history it will show the previous trades that it has made in total it made four trades I will show you the exact results in a moment but first let me show you here failed signals because some of you may experience failed signals first the most common reason for failure is probably if your order size is smaller than the minimum required for trading as i explained in the beginning i recommend to check out the minimum by typing here zero and it will show you the minimum for each trade and the second reason what happened here is that if you have chosen long it will not short the asset so it cannot start with the short you can see it triggered sell but since i didn't have a position open it failed for the first one but once the first buy has been done then it's able to sell so it does exactly what you want it to do and now let me quickly show you the calculations of this example plan i have put the numbers on the chat gpt and you can see the total gross pnl was more than nine cents profitable but the fees ate more than 22 cents so the total profit and loss is minus 12 cents and this is a perfect example what happens if you choose too short time frame it will be trading a lot but the fee may eat almost all of your profit and you may even lose money thanks to the fees let's see if our new bot has executed some trades while i have been talking and you can see right here there are already some orders made i click here for view details I zoom in and scroll down a little bit and you can see the order history we have the first buy order and you can see here on the fade signals the first one again failed because it was to sell and I had long bitcoin so that's why the first one goes right here but the second sell will go into order history because now it's able to sell my current open position if you are using market orders your trades almost never go into open orders right here that only happens with the limit orders you can see the trade right here that the bot has opened for me btc usdc and here it is it may close at any moment because the bot is currently running and you can see what happened market sell order field it just closed it in front of your eyes now if i refresh the page once and i click for the bots i click webhook signal trading you can see that there is again one more order triggered and that was the sell order let me just show you here on the order history here it is sell order has been filled now if you want to pause or delete your bots it's really easy you can simply click here pause and you can see the bot has been paused if you want to continue with the same bot again you can simply click the same button continue now the bot is again running if you ever want to delete the bot you can simply click here terminate click here confirm it has successfully been terminated and it goes from active to terminated let me also terminate this other example i click here confirm and you can see we are on the clean slate unless you want to use the same strategy and same alert again you may want to delete it also from your trading view so it doesn't keep on notifying you all the time so you come into alerts and you click here delete and then you click here delete alert now that you have seen how to trade with the webhook signal trading using trading view do you want to learn how to use also the built-in trading bots on binance these are more beginner friendly because you don't need any external platforms or tools for this these are already available on binance with just a couple of clicks of a button 
My favorite is of course the simplest and the easiest one, the Bitcoin DCA, also known as Convert Recurring. You can see here I have earned more than $28,000 profit with just one plan. So if you want to see exactly how this and other Binance trading bots work, I invite you personally to come to my playlist Learn to make money on Binance because here I will show you how to use Binance trading bots, how to trade futures on Binance, how to use Binance app and much more. Simply take one of your fingers right now, click right here in the corner and learn to make money on Binance right now.